if we look at the India, uh, first of all, GDP is very important because GDP growth rate tracks very closely with uh, aviation uh, traffic growth rates. And uh, what we are seeing in the India passenger jet fleet size is a massive growth in the number of airplanes that are domiciled in the India market. In 1999, uh, we saw just over 100 airplanes, 112 uh, airplanes in the uh, India uh, market. In 2019, that jumped up to uh, over 560 airplanes. Uh, what we are forecasting through the next 20 years is a 4x growth uh, to over 2,300 airplanes in the uh, India uh, jet uh, fleet. Uh, if we look at our 20-year forecast for new airplane deliveries to India, uh, we are forecasting over this period uh, 22,230 airplanes, of which nearly 90% will be on the single aisle size uh, airplane. Uh, however, that still leaves uh, 260 airplanes, a massive number of wide-body airplanes uh, that we are forecasting to be delivered to uh, Indian Airlines. Next page, please. If we look at the 2019 fleet, uh, about 580 airplanes, uh, slightly lower than that, but about 580 airplanes. Uh, over the next 20 years, we are forecasting that only about 110 or about a fifth of those airplanes will be retained. Uh, the rest of those uh, 470 or so airplanes uh, will be for replacement. That's about 21% of the future deliveries for replacement. And nearly 80% of the future deliveries will be for growth in, in India. Uh, for a total of uh, about 2,340 airplanes in our view of the 2039 fleet. Uh, so quite impressive numbers. Uh, in terms of environmental excellence, uh, Boeing has a very strong commitment to environmental excellence. Uh, it starts first with airplane technology. Uh, every year, or, I'm sorry, not every year, every uh, new generation airplane uh, brings on average between 15 and 25% improvement in carbon emissions and fuel efficiencies.